Monday morning, people. Time to wake up. 7.53. You're watching BT Vancouver, and we'll talk entertainment. Unfortunately, we start with two pieces of sad news because we lost a couple of legends. Uh, we'll start off with Jerry Stiller, the actor and comedian best known for portraying Frank Costanza in Seinfeld. He has passed away at the age of 92. His son, Ben Stiller, confirmed on Twitter. He also starred with Ben in Zoolander. Now, many people think, oh, he was just the dad from Seinfeld, but his career went all the way back to the 60s. He appeared on the Ed Sullivan Show 36 times with his wife, Ann Mira, and they were a popular comedic duo. And then after he finished Seinfeld, he went on a nine-year run on uh, King of Queens as another sort of uh, bitter uh, father, if you will. But um, he grew up in New York, was very passionate about the art scene there, and uh, was a true Hollywood legend and uh, had numerous roles in various movies and TV shows and uh, was a comedic legend. So we are honoring the passing of Jerry Stiller, unfortunately, who passed away of natural causes. Over the weekend as well, rock and roll legend Little Richard died at the age of 87. His groundbreaking blend of boogie woogie, rhythm, blues, gospel, you name it, he did it all with hits like Tutti Frutti, Good Golly, Miss Mom, and uh, Lucille, Long Tall Sally. At his peak in the 50s and 60s, he uh, really reunited and, and brought together uh, fans that were uh, from different cultures in, an, in a time when the U.S. was very segregated. And artists like Mick Jagger, Paul McCartney, James Brown, David Bowie, they've all uh, cited Little Richard as an influence. So he died at uh, the age of 87 after a battle with cancer. Okay, and yesterday, John Krasinski, who is actually an ordained minister now, on his show, Some Good News, he surprised some newlyweds with an office wedding reunion. Take a look. And Susan and John, because you so elegantly ripped off our show for your proposal, I feel like it's only fitting that you rip off the wedding, too. So, let's rock. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can't play this song unless you let me invite some of my family to the party. Ladies and gentlemen, the cast of The Office. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> and there they are. Steve Carell, Mindy Kaling, they're all in this one. Uh, so this Maryland couple, they reenacted a wedding proposal from the office where Jim proposed to Pam outside a convenience store. Then Krasinski married them himself because he's an ordained minister. He had them on video conference, invited both sets of parents and their friends, and then he surprised them with this crazy office reunion. That John Krasinski's doing great work with some good news. And you know we could all use a bit of that right now. All right, Russ has your full forecast when we come back.